Happy Sunday, everyone, from the Spencer Homestead. My husband suggested maybe I do a little video on um, what you might need to start with chicks. These little beauties are Brahmas and Olivegers. We got them about a week and a half ago. Um, yours, when you get them brand new, are going to be probably half this size. So what I do is I have a big stock tank to start with. Um, it isn't the largest one, probably the medium one. I got this from Tractor Supply. And um, you'll need a chick water. This little water I love. I bought this at Tractor Supply too. It has three stages of legs on it. It doesn't have to have any legs, and then the legs itself have two heights to them. A little feeder, and then instead of a heat lamp, I do have a red light here because I like red lights, but um, that isn't a heat lamp. This is a board heater. It's a uh, Producer's Pride, I believe. I got that at Tractor Supply, too. Um, we just put it so that <clears throat> it's got like a little bit of depth to it the little chicks could get underneath it um i had a thermometer underneath to make sure that the temperature was up when you first get them the first week it, i believe it's 95 degrees and then it goes down five degrees every week after that so you have to keep these little guys warm too um as far as food i personally do a high protein I do a game bird starter mixed with chick starter. I never use medicated. Uh, it's a personal preference. I don't feel that you should be giving them medication if they don't need it. Um, for water, I do every other day, I do a homemade DIY, DIY um, mixture of a splash of honey, a splash of apple cider vinegar, a pinch of pink Himalayan salt, and a pinch of baking soda, and probably half of this container. And um, I do that every other day, and then clean water alternating with it. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else really not you just have to keep them warm you have to give them plenty of food and clean fresh water keep their bedding clean um i use puppy pads the first couple weeks and um pine shavings on top and then see how they're starting to really rat around in them so they'll probably be cut off from the puppy pads soon um i have some new hatches coming in a few days um, it's my first time hatching, so I'm kind of excited. So we'll have those, and I'm going to split this tank up a little bit so that the little ones can get a little bit stronger before I let them in with these bigger ones. But, uh, if you have any questions, drop them below. Uh, if you like my channel, subscribe, um, and tell your friends. Uh, share my videos. Thank you so much, and have a great day.